Hey everyone, welcome to the Unbox Fab YouTube channel. In today's episode, we are opening a judge pack, hoping that we get something nice because it was a pretty expensive judge pack. And then after that, uh, this is actually, I think, the last video I'm uploading before the Nationals, which will happen, uh, well, here in Manila this weekend. So we, the team is preparing, we're all doing playtests. I'm actually headed off in a few to play a few games of CC. Uh, so yeah, just wishing everyone good luck. And then, after, oh, by the way, after opening the Dodge Pack, I'll just go around, talk to a couple of people from Team Unbox, and get their picks, I guess, for who their maybe dark horses are for the upcoming national. So yeah, let's go. So guys, we have the Judge Pack Season 1 dito. Bubuksan natin siya. It only has one card, right? Yes. And what card are we going after? Cash in? Pommel? ALS. Arc Light Sentinel. And again, you only get one card. And this usually sells for around 200 to $300. So hopefully we're lucky. Jigs? Am I opening no, it? you okay. you hold the hammer. <laughs> hey, game, game, game. Okay, let's go. Do we need scissors? Yeah, what if you... Ooh, yeah. Don't bend the card. Don't bend the card. Yeah. So what's the worst card you can get? I don't know. I think it's a good one. I think it's a good one. Yeah, it's a good one. There's a back. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're gonna just turn it over real quick? No, 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 some some are more dramatic. Sa side. Bot the bottom, 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 the bottom, the bottom. Side, Wait, no, we're done. It doesn't have a rarity, right? It's all P. Yes, it's all. P. But there's a yellow. Ah, there's an attack value. Attack. Wounded bull. Wounded bull. Wounded bull. <laughs> wounded bull, lang ba? I think so. It's red. It's red. Wounded bull. Wounded bull. Red wounded bull. It's a red wounded, it's a red bull. wounded bull. I have no idea. Is it cheap? I don't know. Am I sad or am I happy? Oh, find out. Yes, can, can someone I find out if I'm happy or am I sad? Carlos current mode. Because we're just looking for a cash-in cold foil. Ooh, shiny. Shiny. Wow, cold foil. Uh, Please put it in the sleeve. Maybe it's cheap, eh? Well, uh, they're, okay, they're, they're all worth something. They're all worth something. Okay, I don't have an extra sleeve. Wait. Crown of dichotomy, you can all take a break. Uh -huh. Add mo na sa briars. I mean, you first print na wounded bull na Arhip. Nasa 84. Put it down. 84 dollars? Yeah. Oh, ayun daw. RF wounded bull, 84 dollars. Oh, so, paano pa? Pag so, gold foil. Gold. So anyway, <laughs> that's our poll. Let's go. If you're interested to buy it, message me. <laughs> Thank you to our 100 plus subscribers. Yay! Yay! 100 plus subscribers. We've uploaded, I think, around 8 or 9 videos already. Uh, so expect more content. Now, in today's episode, we're going to talk to different members of Team Unbox to talk about their dark horse picks for the upcoming national. Things you should know me by now if you've been watching our content. Yes. Um, my dark horse picks for nuts. Um, well, for for dark horse, that's 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 like something that's out of the meta. Right? I haven't seen a lot of Viserai players, but I feel like someone's gonna someone's gonna go like, hey, what if I can just like. Tur turn up to Nats and then build like 50 rune chance and swing or something like that. Uh, maybe, oh, maybe, maybe Vincent. People, people aren't so sure yet the power level of Vincent, right? So maybe you will see a few Vincents turning up. Um, I think that's it. Those two rune blades are the ones that I'm pretty sure. There are some people out there Thinking brewing, yeah, and brewing. They're, they're brewing their deck, and yeah, I think that that's my dark horse pick for Nats. Dark Horse pick for the Nationals is Phi, particularly the Ember Blade build. This is because with Lexi being the aggro, best aggro deck at the moment, we can't really compete in terms of damage. So the next best thing we will do is play a little bit slower and, you know, play a little bit more mid-range. Which, surprisingly, Phi is good at because he has a lot of 3 blocks from those Dragonic stuff and you can add some ninja stuff that also has 3 blocks in them. So you can, in theory, like sideboard your usual um, defense reacts and reinforce the line and Lexi and slow them down enough for you to chip them with Ember Blades and Phoenix Flame and probably take the win. Hello, I am Jaime Manzano and my Dark Horse pick for 2023 Nats is Dorinteo. 
<laughs> of course. Oh, so, so Do you want to expound? Why? Yeah, the, the top three decks I'm expecting this meta are Lexi, uh, Icelander, Dromai, and maybe the fourth year would be Bravo. And I think Dory has good matchups. Not really good, but around average to playable matchups on all the four meta heroes I'm expecting. So part of the player skill will, will come yeah. in heavily. So uh, I'm expecting these top four heroes won't have a lot of experience with Dory. And I think that Dory can edge out a win here. In There's a hero that I think will surprise people that will do really well. AKA Dark Horse. I just said it in a different way. Ah. <laughs> Not necessarily win it, but like a I hero that you think will do well. Oh, yeah, now people are not expecting. I want it to be Azalea. Spicy. Yeah, I want Azalea to do well. Because? Because I want to play some Azalea. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. <laughs> so there you have it. It's a very quick, straightforward vlog. I just want to put something together before the nationals. Um, for me, my hope and my pick still is Briar. Hopefully, she still, you know is able to get into the top eight. Maybe we finally get to see her go living legend uh, here in the Philippines in Manila. That would be sick. So that would pretty much be my dark horse and my favorite. I'm actually going to play, chances are very, very, very high that I will be playing Briar for the Nationals. If not Briar, it will most likely be Lexi. So it's just a toss up between the two based on the play testing that I'll be doing in the next two to three days before the big event. So anyway, to everyone participating in, you know, the Nationals in whatever country you're in, hoping you guys do well. And as usual, thanks for watching. Please do subscribe to the channel, give the video a thumbs up, and comment down below. And I will see you in the next one.